Oh, so tired. Oh, where is my car? It was just like parking here. Where is gone? Let's do some magic and make my car visible. Wow. You like it? Let's go for a long drive. Welcome to Magic Fun Studio. Today we are going to learn this amazing car appearing magic trick. I'm sure you have seen this kinds of trick in the movie like magically car is coming up here. So we are going to learn this today. Before you're going to learn, please whoever did not subscribe to my channel, kindly subscribe my channel and on the notification button. So let's go for the tutorial. Always remember before you start this trick, you Keep your camera on the tripod and make we are going to do this one single shot before you start these tricks make sure you have taken the background phrase so we should do the same frame rate what I will do with the continuous shot so just keep your camera on the tripod let's have a look at the real video shot which is the thing before starting to start in this way this shot was taken in the tripod and it was continuous shot. Let's have a look. So I can run to the car quickly because I and then I take the car out of the frame. Why I take the out of the frame? This is the frame I am going to use it after as a background. So I get in my uh, frame, then I park the car exactly in the same position. So nothing will change, my camera is still fixed. So I go back and after I just make an act. Actually, car in front of me, and I'm acting. What is my car? Now, let's do some magic trick, and that's the effect I'm going to do after the editing. So let's take this two shot to the Adobe Premiere Pro and start to do your magic camera trick. After we bring the shot to the Adobe Premiere Pro, as I told you, you have to find your background picture. So to find the background picture, what I'm going to do, I'm going to go into the little bit forward. And uh, just to show you, this is the, my clip. I go a little bit forward and I will until find the right position of the car. So the car was coming inside in this position. So I stop my car here and then I make a cut between the frame exactly like here. So I get it, the empty shard, which is you see from the beginning. So I click the shard and go to the frame hold option. You just add the frame hold since the frame hold option is done, you take the, so you have it cut on middle of the clip, right? And then you take the second shot on the video number two. So I'm going to do the second shot on the video number two. Now there's a question even. Uh, so what I'm going to do now, I'm going to find out because as I'm only one person taking the two shot, so I cannot keep this first, this position, I have to make a cut. So I go out of the frame and you make cart exactly here. So you park the car and I'm going out of the frame. Since I don't have the video camera, that's why I have to do that. So just clear it and now you're ready to go and expand the frame hold button until the end. Then just go to the effect control and uh, select the video number two and make a mask on that. So video number mask. You need to adjust a little bit this video mask. Make sure it's adjusted nicely, a little bit far, and then go invert mode. Click the option and invert and keep the video number two selected. So you see, and now the video number two exactly on the same position is not visible anymore. But there's a one line somewhere. But if you see the real shot, actually, the car in front of me. <laughs> this is the real shot. So what are you going? We're going to do a mask adjustment will make a keyframe for the mask so now you see when it's the car is not visible anymore so we make a keyframe already now we're going to adjust the mask according to the movement of mine so see you go two three frame forward and you take the mask back because since it's make a keyframe it will adjust it so again you go two three frame forward and take your mask a little bit in the back 
see it's make a, it's make a keyframe already so you go you do this frame by frame so it will be looks more natural and you start to do until the end it will take a little bit more time time since you have to do until make sure your car is totally visible so since you this position your masking is done and this effect already should working right now i'm going to show you now see if i play this video again from the beginning and according to the act since i make a keyframe and the car is appearing but the problem is it look like something on the top is covering <laughs> it's not look natural we are going to fix it that things right now to fix these things also it's very simple just i need to feather the mask so see it's not look natural so we are going to defect control and select the max number one and feather the mask according to the scenario so if you see it here we'll feather the mask and we'll adjust it as long as it looks perfect i think it's perfect now then adjustment is done and now you see it's natural and look like the car is appearing in front of me that's it <laughs>